Unshackled from shadows. She will rise in moonlit glory and carve a path of brightness to the accursed one's second death. So saith the wise Alondo. That beacon of angelic wrath has taken the fight to Catherick on the rooftop. In the first line of defense are dead. All right. But storming the tower won't be easy. And if we wait too long, Catherick will gather his strength right. and retaliate. Uh, let's check our entries. We freed Nightsong and she flew across the Shadow Curse lands to Moonrise Tower where she intends to face Catherick Thorn. Nice. We freed Nightsong and... Okay. Alright. So, find Nightsong. What does the wizard in the border gates want with her? That is true. The Chosen of Shar. We convince Shadowheart to turn her back on Shar's wishes and instead free Shadowheart. Rather than become a dark justiciar, Shadowheart will instead likely face dire consequences for her action. Uh, Shar has punished Shadowheart by stripping her of all favors and exiling. Okay. All right. Well, that's nice, I guess. Uh, I need to take a rest. So, before we go and do that, let's go to let's 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 go to last in. Yeah, let's go to last light in. And we can talk to see if there is any changes, right? We can also take a rest. What's happening out there? Who was that streaking across the sky? An immortal. But it couldn't possibly be. Never mind. It doesn't matter. What matters is you have him in a corner. Jahira and every fighting body in this place have gone to Moonrise Towers to face Ketherick down. She's waiting for you there. End this. Now. We're all counting on you. Alright. Uh, so let's take a rest. Right. I probably need it. Ah. Gail, what's happening with you? Good evening. I'm here on behalf of Gail of Waterdeep. He wishes to extend you an invitation for a private conversation in a more suitable locale. Gladly. Simply follow yonder path and soon you will find him. Need to long rest? Okay, fine. I love this time of night. There's an almost reverent silence that accompanies the peak of darkness, when you'd almost believe the dawn will never break. The cradle of eternity. Uh. The timelessness of lovers. That most beautiful of fantasies. Indeed. The curse is still present, of course. Just veiled and at arm's length for now. Not a trick I can repeat often, but tonight... Tonight is different. Why? This may be my last night alive. I wanted it to be under a canopy of... beauty and wonder. 
I thought this place might bring me peace. I thought it might make the weight of what I must do feel a little lighter. But I'm not so sure. Babe or crone, coward or hero, death is assured. Mistra's forgiveness is not. If you knew the end was near, would you not want to ensure it had meaning? I am terrified. Hmm. I will not claim otherwise. My face could scarcely conceal it, even if my words sought to deny it. There is no point in running from the inevitable. Better to meet it on my own terms. Heartening words. If only they came from the lips of another. This is no time for delusion. We are not close, you and I. But it will not matter soon enough. Let us just enjoy the view in silence. We will leave the world a better place than it is tonight. <sighs> Harsh words from Gale, huh? We are not close, you and I. I was hoping to speak to you, as a matter of fact, about the night you were kind enough to keep this melancholy wizard company. I wanted to... to thank you. I was sinking into a dark place. But you reminded me there is still light in the world, if I should care to look for it. Mm -hmm. You... you may well have prevented me from doing something very rash in the near future. I count myself lucky to call you a friend. Hmm, <laughs> careful. I may just take you up on that. All right. I suppose it was only a matter of time until Shah took vengeance. For the Lady of Loss, she does not like losing. The thing that will decide my fate forevermore. Yes, it's been on my mind. Why? Well, in theory, it's simple. Destroy Casador, stop ritual. That's assuming <laughs> we want to stop the ritual. What do you have well, in mind? <laughs> I've obviously thought about it. If I was the one who completed the ritual, I'd have such power. And I could walk in the sun without fear I'd turn into a mind flare. <laughs> I don't relish it, but my siblings lured thousands of people to their deaths over the years. I doubt Baldur's Gate would miss them. All right, I'm convinced. <laughs> of course, I don't even know if I could complete the ritual. It may be impossible, but it certainly is tempting. Sure. All right, let's go and complete all this stuff to the Moonrise Tower, right? Uh, so I installed like this. Uh, the grid is gone now, basically. So it's much more clearer, basically. You know, and another thing is, Moon Maiden, I just moved them to side, you. right? Which is much more better, in my opinion, because it was showing all of kind of stuff before. I mean, when I talked to Astarian, you can see, what can I do see, you, it's friend? a constructual, right? So, which is nice, right? 
So if I talk to her, maiden, protect, see, I can still see you. them. Right. So which is nice. I could make the action bar like contextual also. Let me know if you guys want that. I f I like it to having the uh, having the action bar visible. Right, it shows me like, and I can make this visible like a contextual. But um, I think this that's just you need some kind of context, right? I think this is okay right? in my opinion. But let me know what you guys think, right? All right, let's go and do the Moonrise Towers. Ooh, wow. Zahira. Let's save it here, won't it? Harper Chanti. She's Helena. Taking on a tower with no siege engines. Wonderful. <laughs> uh, fist Aubrey. Unshackled from shadows. She will rise in moonlit glory and carve a path of brightness to the accursed one's second death. So saith the wise Alondo. That beacon of angelic wrath has taken the fight to Catherick on the rooftop. In the first line of defense are dead. All right. But storming the tower won't be easy, and if we wait too long, Catherick will gather his strength and retaliate. For now, though, he's on the back foot for the first time since he returned from the grave. This is it. The spearhead moment. You brought us this far. So how shall we proceed? If you're hunting one target among many, the key is to isolate and corner it. My Harpers and I will be the noose that closes in around Catherick, and as it tightens, you'll go in for the kill. Floric left some of her flaming fist. They'll scout the prisons and the barracks below to ensure we're not taken by surprise. Say the word, and we're off. Should I have Jahira join my party? She's a druid, right? Mm. No, I think it's fine. I like Astarian in my current party. At the ready, Harpers! In this light, there will be victory. In this light, we will avenge the fallen! <sighs> the time has come. Gatherick will taste of death at last. Ooh. Shadow to shadow. Take that. Uh, ability drain. Once per turn when you make an attack uh, roll, the attack reduces the target's corresponding ability by one. Uh, stage fright. Mm, shield of thralls. Conjure a volatile shield around yourself or an ally. Shionic backlash. I mean, the reaction spell is always nice, right? It's a passive feature, right? You must be. More, you must be concentrating on another spell to cast this. If the target Once was more, concentrating. You heal as much as the damage that was done to it. I think this will be good, in my opinion. And then you have Shionic Backlash, Cull the Weak. So these are toggleable passive features. When you bring a creature down to fewer hit points than your number of evolved illithid powers, it dies and all nearby creatures take 1 to 4 psychic damage. Okay. Zella. Now we'll move this a little bit in. We'll take that. Zealot. Uh, let's do that. 
Shionic backlash. Let's use that. Call the weak. We'll use that. Moving ahead. All right. So what we'll do is let's do this. We'll do extended spell, I guess. Let's try that. That. Okay, nice. Because she's probably gonna do. Oh, it's a mirror image, huh? Absolute edges. Agent is blast. So she's a warlock, so she can do the. And her what? AC is 23. Wow. And she has resistance against fire. Okay. So that's pretty bold. Uh, flame strike. Makes a pillar of divine fire roar down from heavens. I guess I can do that, right? If I mean, she's obviously not affected, but the other people are. Right, so let's do Time that. To meet your maker. Yep. So Mig is half done. And we'll do. Let's say Great Sword, I guess. Let's put that here. That's fine. Uh. We'll do lightning. Let's do that. So they'll do mental fatigue. Nice. Okay. Psionic overload. Uh, I could go there and do that, but Zahira. So next turn is Zahira's. Still on my feet. At the ready. So he's not in the battle yet. So let's do one thing. My pleasure. Ah. Uh, is this? It's a high defense. Okay. Why don't you come close? Let's do that. Haste. Nice. Uh, we will do dash. Let's uh, try to silence her. Nice. So she is dead. <laughs> nice. And. Well, so much for peace. Another fight. Let's go. Ah, a little fun at last. Okay. Jahira. Nice. Ooh. Oh wow. Ah. All right. This one needs to go. Zahira is pretty hard. So Yeah, let's do that. Okay. And all right. So you do
that. Nice. Radiant damage. I guess just do this. So she's dead. Nice. Go a little bit closer. No gloom, all doom. Go a, bit, a little bit closer. Alright. So they are grouped up nicely. So I feel like Yeah, let's do here. They are grouped up nicely. The wrong fight, friend. Okay, I can I mean, a stallion would be blinded. Uh, let's do that. So they are down. This hunger of Hedar thing is really problematic, huh? Alright, for you... I feel like he should fly and then do that. Exactly, this is the issue, right? Like this hunger of Hedar thing is really problematic, man. So now Nice, okay Now Silence Here As long as they get close. Ooh. This guy is who's doing the hunter of Hedar? Ooh wow. This guy, right? Ah. Still alive, seriously? Uh. 
Astarian. This guy, this guy, this guy. Okay, fine. Then we'll do... Nice. Where do I go from here? All right. This guy needs to die. So let's do that. Mass healing. Nice. And we will do superior healing for her. I don't have much left of those, but it's fine. Uh, let's do it. Nice. Nice. Ah! How many hungers of head are they gonna do, man? Ah! Be useful. Uh, let's do a short rest. Oh, that's at the edge of. Yeah, Scroll of Shatter. Absolutes Protector. Absolutes Ages. This is for the brand, right? I don't think I need that. Really can't okay. Rest, huh? <laughs> Harbor of Vigilance. So I guess I didn't need to buy that. We'll take that. Cleaver. And I'm encumbered, huh? Let's use this. So I think call the week.
I can use this one ability drain once per turn when you make an attack roll the attack reduces the number this is a passive feature right so that's nice right when a, once per turn when you make an attack roll the attack reduces the target's corresponding ability by one right so I guess that's fine but as long as we hold this floor, the tower is ours. I'll stay here. Ensure no one comes up or down without a scimitar welcome. You're close now. A final audience with Ketherick Thorm awaits. Ha! Huh. Keen eye. I suppose I could be persuaded. Fair enough. The time has come. Gatherick will taste of death at last. 